Hi, this is Trish Kelly, owner of Australian Labradoodles Midwest Connection. I'm here with Cooper, who had a litter of 11 puppies on February 28th. These puppies are two days old, and the dad is Dublin. You can meet, uh, excuse me, you can view both of them on my Meet the Parents page on my website. Um, the puppies are adorable. They've taken after pretty much Dublin's straight coat. A couple of them have a little bit of a wave to them, and they're slowly getting um, adopted, but I do have um, a number of them still available. And I'm just going to go through and point out the couple that um, are adopted right now. And um, let's see, this maroon girl right here, let me hone in on her a little bit. This is Cody. And I know her collar comes up red, but it's really a maroon co collar. But here she is just kind of sleeping with her, sucking on a teat there. Um, oh, there, here comes Cooper popping in. But this is Cody. This one right here. Let me see if I can show you Cody a little bit. Come here, Cody. You can see Cody. That's Cody. Come here, you. Can you look up at the camera? There you go. There he is. That's Cody. Maroon collar. And that's one of our bigger boys. The other one that is spoken for is the beige collar. And we don't have a name yet. This is the beige collared one. We can turn this one around a little bit. This one too is uh, nursing away. Beautiful puppies. Oh my gosh, these coats are stunning. And um, so that's the beige collar. He's going to slip and slide till he can, latches on there. I'm going to come around this side. So you can see their faces a little bit. So again, this is the beige one. He's looking for... Teat. I'll show him that one there. He'll hop on that one. Maybe not. This is the only one that's a cream. Great big fella. He's definitely available. Beautiful straight coats. He's a great big one also. This little girl is stunning. I shouldn't say little. She's the biggest of the litter with the purple collar. Right here. She, um, I believe, is adopted. I'm waiting to hear from a family yet. And the other little girl is the pink one down here. Now she's still available. She is gorgeous. Nice blocky head on her. She's a little bit thinner. She's not going to be as stocky as the other ones, but she's beautiful. And... Let's see what else we've got this. Oh, that's the brown one with the brown collar with the cream, cream body. Oh, Cooper's checking out what I'm doing here. This is the blue puppy, the blue collared puppy. Beautiful red straight coat, very much like Daddy Dublin. Beautiful head, gorgeous face on him. Just a gorgeous puppy. And that too comes up like a light blue collar, but it's actually a darker collar. Oh, who else do we got here? Who's under here? The green. This little green boy is just adorable. He's just a little bit smaller than the other ones. And he had a little, um, little bit of a scab that's healing up on the top of his head. So that's what that is. Um, but he's beautiful. He's got a great, great face, nice and square head, and uh, nice dark, nice dark puppy. This green one. He'll probably be in the oh, 20, 29, 30 pound range when he's full grown. And then we got this beautiful yellow boy back here, yellow collar. He's going to have a slight curl to his or a wave to his coat. I can tell when a puppy is born, if they have a little zigzag down their spine, that tells me they're going to have a slight curl to their coat, or wave to their coat. 
versus, for instance, the maroon here who's just got straight hairs going down. So that's a little different how we can tell very early on. This other one that's just gorgeous is this black collared puppy. Another big solid male. Big stocky boy. Nice square head. Um, nice coat. Cooper's kicking me here. Um, nice coat that's um, a little bit wavy. Uh, very little wave. So straight to a, to a slight wave in that guy. He's pushing his way up. I'm going to put this guy on the teeth here. So I'm just going to film him for a few minutes so you can see what 11 puppies looks like at two days old. Let me come around the other side now. I apologize for all the movement here. There's Cooper checking everything out. You can just see how they um, fight away trying to get up there. Get up and get a teat. I'll do this often. I'll take this big girl off, or big boy off, and put this little girl on. Just so that the little ones get up there and get a teat too. Get nice nourishment just as equal time. And then we'll put, this guy's looking down here. We'll put him back over here if he wants some. There, get down there, you. So this is the little pink girl that's still available. There was only two girls. One is spoken for, and the rest are big, healthy boys. There he goes. That's the maroon collared one that's pushing and Pushing all the other ones out of the way there. She's got to shift around like that, Mom does, just to make room for them all and make sure they're all getting a little little nourishment every day. And basically, this is all they do every day for a good week or two, eat, sleep, and poop. Here again is the beige colored puppy. The maroon one in the, in the center is um, the darkest one in the litter. Big male. And they actually aren't nursing on those two top teats right now because they emptied them. So they're looking for the ones lower now to suckle on. This red one here, red collared puppy, I believe is going to be taken. That's another stunning look-alike to Daddy Dublin. In fact, I was teasing the family and said his name should be D Dublin Jr., so, just got a couple of beautiful pups still available, um, quite a few available. So, if you're interested, you can either call me at 262-628-3522 or send me an email through my website, go to the Contact Us tab, and um, let me know what, what you're interested in. It's usually first come, first serve and it's a $300 deposit and then uh, the final price is $2,500. I do ship puppies um, and that uh, fee varies from what area you're having it shipped to. Some families opt to have somebody fly in and fly it right back home on the same, um, same airlines with them. So I hope you enjoyed this video and enjoy uh, the day nice sunny day and if you're interested in one of these don't wait long they're going to go fast all the other puppies that we did have available are now adopted so this is the only litter currently available i just want to turn this red one around so you can see the face on him this is the one that looks a lot like i think look, looks like dublin whoop whoop <laughs>
Oh my goodness. This is resilience. He's fine. <laughs> That's why he's built the way he is. So I hope you enjoyed that video. He's going to push his way right back to the teat he was on. and Or try and push the maroon one off here. Let me see if he'll go on this one here. There we go, big guy. So that's the one that looks like, to me, like Dublin. Well, they all do, but. <laughs> they wrestle with these back and forth. But um, then they push with their front paws, and that stimulates the milk to flow into their mouths. So just looking, just uh, not that puppy looking yet at this age. Another two, three days, they'll start to look more like puppies, but that's how they are at two days old. So, again, the phone number, if you're interested, is 262-628-3522. Thank you.